Muriel Furrer. Remember that name. A name that held such promise. A name whispered with awe in Swiss cycling circles. She was a rising star. A junior national champion. Destined for greatness. 19 years old. 19 years of raw talent and fierce determination. She had the heart of a lion, the legs of a gazelle. The future gleamed bright, full of victories waiting to be claimed. The world lay at her feet. But fate, it seems, had other plans. The 2024 Road World Championships in Zurich. A day that would go down in history. A day etched in every cyclist's memory. The culmination of years of training, sacrifice and dreams. A day of celebration, of national pride, of fierce competition. Flags from around the world waved proudly. The air crackled with anticipation. Spectators lined the streets, their excitement palpable. The world watched as young riders dared to dream, their eyes filled with determination and hope. The women's junior road race, a challenging course, technical descent, sharp turns, every twist and turn a new challenge, a test of skill, nerve and endurance, each rider pushing their limits. Muriel, a picture of focus, lined up with her Swiss teammates ready to conquer. The peloton surged forward, a wave of energy, a kaleidoscope of colours against the backdrop of the Swiss Alps. Nature's beauty framing human endeavour. The crowd roared, urging the riders on, their cheers a symphony of support. Each pedal stroke a testament to years of dedication, every movement a reflection of countless hours of training. Dreams hung in the balance, the finish line a beacon of hope and achievement. Kilometre 60, a sharp bend, a moment of chaos, a touch of wheels, a rider goes down, then another, and another, a sickening thud, screams piercing the air, Muriel, down, unmoving, silence descended, heavier than the mountains themselves. The peloton fractured, riders swerving to avoid the carnage. A collective gasp rippled through the crowd. A sense of dread hung heavy in the air. The world held its breath. Time seemed to stand still. The race, now insignificant, faded into the background. All eyes on the fallen figure. All thoughts, all prayers, with Muriel. Medical teams rushed to her side. Frantic activity, the whir of a helicopter. She was airlifted to the University Hospital of Zurich, the severity of her injuries unknown. Days turned into an agonizing wait. The cycling world united in prayer. Hope flickered, fragile but present. Her teammates, her family, her country clung to it desperately. But fate, it seemed, was a cruel mistress. Despite the best efforts of medical staff, her condition deteriorated. Head injuries, internal bleeding, a fight for every breath. October 1st, 2024. The news, when it came, shattered the cycling world. Muriel Furrer, the young Swiss champion, succumbed to her injuries. She was just 19. Silence. Disbelief. Then, an outpouring of grief. From the Swiss Cycling Federation, from her team, from fellow cyclists, from fans around the world, tributes poured in, painting a picture of a talented athlete, a fierce competitor, and a kind soul. A light extinguished too soon, a future unfulfilled, a void left in the hearts of those who knew her, a sport united in mourning. Section 6 Echoes of Past Tragedies Muriel's death 
is a stark reminder of the inherent risks of cycling. The sport, while exhilarating and freeing, carries with it a shadow of danger that is ever-present. A sport where danger lurks around every corner. Every twist and turn on the road can be a potential hazard, and the margin for error is razor-thin. Where a moment of inattention can have tragic consequences, the speed and intensity of the races leave no room for mistakes, and even the most experienced riders can fall victim to unforeseen circumstances. It echoes past tragedies that have shaken the cycling world. These incidents serve as somber reminders of the sport's perilous nature. The death of Fabio Casartelli in the 1995 Tour de France. His loss was a profound moment in cycling history, highlighting the inherent dangers of the sport. The loss of Ruta Weyland in a crash at the 2011 Giro d'Italia. His tragic accident left a lasting impact on the cycling community, reminding everyone of the risks involved. And closer to home, the passing of Swiss rider Gino Merda in a crash at the Tour de Suisse earlier this year. His untimely death has left a void in the hearts of many. Each tragedy, a gut-wrenching reminder of the fragility of life. The cycling community comes together to mourn and remember those who have been lost. A reminder that cycling, despite its beauty and allure, can be a cruel and unforgiving sport. The thrill of the ride is always accompanied by the spectre of danger, making every race a test of skill, endurance and fate. Section 7. A Sport in Mourning The international cycling community mourns the loss of one of its own, a tragic event that has left a deep void in the hearts of many. A young talent taken too soon, a future unwritten, her potential was limitless, her passion for the sport evident in every race she competed in. The peloton, a tight-knit family, grieves for their fallen comrade. They ride not just as competitors, but as friends, as a community bound by shared experiences and mutual respect. Social media platforms overflowed with messages of condolence from fellow cyclists, from teams, from cycling governing bodies and from fans who admired her spirit and dedication. From fans across the globe, all united in grief, in shared memories and in the hope that her legacy will inspire future generations of cyclists. In a sense of loss that transcended borders and languages. The global cycling community stands together, honoring her memory the hashtag Shad Ride for Muriel trended worldwide, a testament to the impact she had on so many lives, both on and off the bike. A virtual peloton of support, united in their grief, remembering a young woman who dared to chase her dreams. Her spirit lives on in every pedal stroke, in every race, and in the hearts of those who knew her. Section 8. Safety. A conversation renewed. Muriel's death reignites the conversation about safety in cycling, a conversation that resurfaces with every tragedy, only to fade into the background as the peloton moves on. Calls for improved safety measures, for safer race courses, for stricter regulations, for greater awareness of the risks involved, for a collective effort to protect the riders who risk their lives in pursuit of glory. The UCI, the sport's governing body, faces renewed scrutiny. Questions are asked, promises are made. But will it be enough? Can anything truly prevent such tragedies from happening again? Section 9. Muriel's Enduring Legacy. Muriel Furrer, a name that will forever be etched in the annals of cycling history. Not for the victories she might have achieved, 
but for the tragic way her life was cut short. Her legacy, a reminder of the fragility of life, a call for greater safety in the sport, but most importantly, a testament to the indomitable spirit of a young woman who dared to dream. Ride on, Muriel. Your spirit will forever inspire. Your memory, a beacon of hope, and a reminder to cherish every moment on the bike